Hey, what's up, everyone? We're uh, we're doing something a little different right here. We're actually removing the uh, OEM charger that came in the boat, and I'm replacing it with a Pro Tournament 300 quad from Pro Mariner. Uh, the main reason I do this is because of the Pro Mariner's low voltage performance, um, which really comes into play when we're at a tournament and and there's a lot of people there sharing the same outlets, looking to get that charge. Uh, the nice thing the Pro Mariner does is it distributes its power as needed to each battery. So when one battery is full, it actually takes that power going to that full battery and redistributes it to the batteries that have less of a charge and need that charge. Instead of just letting that bank sit idle, it actually does something with it. So you can see right now we've got the old charger out. Uh, we're going to try to find a spot to get this to fit nicely. And uh, from there we'll show you the uh, rest of the install. All right, so we got our charger mounted. We had to reconfigure the battery trays a little bit, but uh, not really a big issue because in most boats they give you plenty of space to go ahead and reconfigure those if you need to. But what I'm going to show you right now is how to actually hook up a 36 volt system. Um, we're going to run the batteries in series and not in parallel. Uh, so what I've done so far is these leads right here are coming right from the trolling motor. And since I am running a 36 volt system, I obviously need three batteries. And what you need to do is designate each battery, battery number one, number two, and number three. So my positive lead here, I have going to the positive on battery number one. And the negative lead, I have going to the negative on battery number three. Now, to bring these batteries in series, what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to take a jumper and I'm going to have to go from my number one battery, the negative, to the positive on my number two battery. So just like that. Now you can see we still have one more open spot. We're going to take a second jumper and we're going to go from the positive of the number three battery to the negative of the number two battery. Just like that. Now our batteries are wired correctly for a 36 volt system. The next thing I need to do is go ahead and just grab the appropriate lead from my Pro Mariner charger. They're all labeled battery one, two, and three. It really makes no difference where they go. You just need to put the corresponding positive with the corresponding negative. However, on the Pro Mariner chargers, there is one lead that is different than the other ones. Um, in the instance for the starting battery, the starting battery is its own lead and is labeled appropriately and um, that's the one you just need to make sure you, you get isolated on your starting battery. And we're good. Successful. Nice.